guys, it's pretty image. image. And these are fun facts you guys should know about us. Let's go. Rambo, I said Rambo, but we looking cute and we ain't worry about no man though. Just me and my fam, bro, and we came to jam, yo. DJ, turn it up and let the party and begin, go. Dabbing and we dancing, bougie but we fancy. Looking left or right, yeah, we see these haters glancing. But I got my army, we just came to party. Pay them no attention cause I shake them haters. Where are you from and how would you describe your city? We are from Clearwater, Florida. We have one of the best beaches in the country. Yes. I can say that we don't really have a lot of support down here. Not at all. So, <laughs> and the water is not clear. It's not clear at all. I don't know why they call it Clearwater. Yes. Mm -hmm. How long have you been doing what you're doing and how did you get started in the first place? We've been doing this for four years, since 2016. And it all started on my sweet 16th birthday when we came to my dad about doing music. And after that, he took it serious and so did we. In your opinion, who is the most influential and successful artist in your genre and why? For me, I would say Cardi B because she came from nothing and now she's basically like a millionaire. Fair. Um, I would say Megan Thee Stallion because she's still in school and she's still pursuing her dreams, so. So what are your current thoughts on the music industry? I will say as female, female artists, it's really hard for us to come up because we don't really have a lot of support. Some people put us down or whatever. Yeah, also, so. um, they expect like all females to be a certain you mm -hmm. know, way to write about the same things to you know come yeah. off the same way so yeah it is kind of hard like you said so. how do you separate yourself from other artists i say that we really don't talk or like write about the same things that maybe some female artists most female artists. <laughs> yeah most female artists don't like rap about so right. we're kind of different um we try to put ourselves in a, not in the category. We try to be like a variety of things. Mm -hmm. We want to be, you know, want to have different genres. We can We're be different. In. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who influenced your style? Um, nobody really influenced our style. I think we actually have a unique style. We're different. I just can say that uh, we're growing. We're trying to, you know, get into new things. You know, we're getting older, so I can say we're just growing. <laughs> What aspect of the music making process excites you most and what aspect discourages you the most? Writing the music, getting into the studio, we're hyped in the studio. Um, what discourages us? Um, getting people to vibe to our new singles that we put out. Yes. So I think that's what discourages us most. Yes, having people, you know, go listen to our music, you know, put it out there, you yeah. know, connecting with, you know, different artists to mm -hmm. try to listen to our music so that they can mm -hmm. be like, oh, maybe I want to get on a track with that or like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it could just be, yeah, just getting the music out there. Mm -hmm. Who would you like to work with in the future? Oh, you want to go first? Yes. Janae Aiko. I love her. I want to work with Justin Bieber. Everybody knows I love Justin Bieber. Yes. Is there a reason you would like to work with those? two artists? I feel like Justin Bieber is different. I've heard some of his new songs now and I feel like they're different from his old songs and I really love them. Janae Eco, she's very personal. She talks about even her own life and sometimes she relates to other people. So it's very like, you know, you can reason with her, you can feel what she felt. So it feels, yeah, I love her, so. <laughs> if you could describe your fans in one word, what would it be and why? You can go first. Should I go? Um, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I would say growing. I only would say that because every day someone's reaching out to our uh, manager, someone's uh, following DMing us. us. Yeah, DMing us. Uh, they just notice us every day. We're growing. It's our growing. Fan base. And we um, do have a name for our fans. They are called Pretty Mob. Exactly. <laughs> Which latest songs, videos, or mixtape releases are currently available to, to your fans? And where can they be heard or downloaded? You can go to our website. Uh, that's where I can link you guys to our YouTube channel, uh, all of our videos. Social media. And music are on there. We are all on all platforms. I'm talking about every platform. iTunes, Amazon Music, Spotify, Google Play. Our website is prettyimage.com. P-R-E-T-T-I-E-M-A-G-E.com. We have Me vs. You. That's out. Me vs. You music video. And about my bag. Make sure y'all go check that out and make that TikTok if you're watching this. But yes. Also... <laughs> We got some shoes that are out called Devachi Street.
great. While we on this website, get into it, y'all. Get these We got shoes. the link in our Instagram <laughs> bio. Y'all need to get them shoes. We got more shoes coming out and a bathing suit line. Yeah. So y'all be on the lookout. So that's all included in this music. Get this. And again, what are your names? I am Miss Attitude. And I'm Baby Girl. And, and we, we are Pretty, Pretty Image. Image.